You have some money with you there? Yes, I do. Okay. Son? Yes. I would like to talk to you. Mom, what is it that you tell me? Can't you until I come back? No, no, no. It can't. Are you sure you're taking the right decision? Mom, why is it that when I tell you that Gina can make a good wife, you don't want to believe me? Even where she had sacrificed when I was in a mess. People get paid off. Oh, come on. What sacrifice are we even talking about here? One that no other person has ever done before? Pay her off. If it is because of the sacrifice. Pay her off. Mom, I don't want to pay her off. I love her. Yes. Oh, no. Let's go. I hope he still understands that I'm capable of making that girl miserable in this palace. You cannot leave me in the middle of the sea. Nobody leaves me in the dark. Uzo, I am coming for you. And I will get what I want. Oh. I'm desperate, and my desperation is loud and severe. Daddy, meet Prince Uzo. Uzo, this is my father. Good day, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. My daughter told me about you, but she never mentioned you are from a three year old. <laughs> Daddy, I wanted to surprise you. That's all right. You're welcome. Thank you, Thank sir. Thank you. Jenna, go and call your mother. Come here and we have visitors. Hey, come is already here. Mom, yes. Meet Prince Uzo, my fiance. I greet you, ma'am. Greetings. Uzo is a prince? Yes. I wanted to surprise you. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. Um, okay, well, Jenna, come and join me in the kitchen. Excuse me. Uh, my dear Zodia. Uh, we want to go straight to the point. Uh, 
Okay, before we proceed, uh, let me ask which kingdom are you from? Hmm. Ozo is the son of late Igwe Ofodile. Ofodile? Yes. Ofodile? Ofodile? Yes, you are correct. And we are here to pluck a beautiful Odala from your house. That's all right. Give me a minute, I'll be right back. He seems not happy. No, maybe he wants to be sure by asking one of his kinsmen. That's a tradition. No problem. If that toy is the son of Lead King of Fodile, you will not marry him. What is it? He has the cunning eyes of his father, who is full of lies and deceit. Please, this day is very important to me, and my entire life depends on it. Please do not spoil it for me. Please, I'm begging you, you don't. Never. I love him. I love him. And I will marry I must marry him. I will never allow my only daughter put her hands into a burning fire. Not when I'm alive. What you are here for will not work. The reason you are here will not be possible. My daughter will not marry you. What? Look, we are from the royal house of Ofodile. Do I have water in my mouth? This is total embarrassment. Huh? You don't even know who we are. I said it. Sounds like his father. So proud. Oh no, I'm out of here. Honey, honey, hold on. Let me call him back. Let me please call him back. My friend. Hey! Oh God. Honey! They are gone. They are gone? How? What happened? Dad, what was the meaning of that? Why did you send them away? Why, Dad? How could you? Wait, please. What is going on? Mom, huh? Dad sent those people away. Can you imagine that? Honey, you sent them away? What happened? Tell your daughter to calm down and listen to me. If she wants to know more about that family, 
that you have nothing to educate me about that family. I know him too well, and that was why I accepted his proposal. Oh, shut up, Gina. No, no, don't tell me to shut up. I will not shut up. But, um, when she comes down, then we'll talk. Oh. What is all this? Tell him. Tell your husband that no matter what he does, I will marry Uzo. Tell him. Honestly, I'm confused myself. Why are your faces like that? My queen, tell one of the mess to give me some water to drink. Please. What happened? Let me drink some water first. Please. I need some water. Son, Uzo, Uzo, open the door. What is it that you cannot tell your mother? Open the door, Nana. never failed in anything I desire. He wants to be the king without a queen. Without me. <laughs> That's impossible. That's impossible. Oh no. My queen. What actually happened there? Her father told us to our faces that his daughter cannot get married to this royal house. And who wants to marry that parasite of a daughter of his anyway? I told my son I don't like that girl. And truly, I am not in support of his marriage to her. No. You see, I wouldn't want to discuss what happened back there with anybody. It is the highest embarrassment of my life. The highest. That thing's father insults the royal house. Okay. Okay. I will never allow my daughter, not my precious daughter, fall into their trap. They will take what you have and abandon you in the middle of nowhere. It's in their DNA. I have never heard anything about King of Odile. But don't you think his son might just be different? This one that just left here? <laughs> he is a replica of his father. 
okay, you know what? Why don't we ask questions about his life? Ofodile used my name to scam a white man. I was in prison for 10 years, 10 good years. He got my cousin from my maternal home pregnant and denied it. Offered the chuffle the pension money of my father into his pocket and left my father to die while I was in the prison. Wait a minute. Honey, are you doing this because of what he did to you? Oh, the offspring of a chameleon will never change its behavior. Dad, I've come to tell you that no matter what you say or do, it will not stop me from marrying Uzo. If the worst comes, I will denounce this family. This on you, Dad. Go ahead, marry Uzo, and nothing, I mean nothing, will happen. Just shut up for once. Shut up for once! Why do you talk to your father in that manner? Eh? Woman, talk to your daughter. It's never late to have everything. think your father will deceive you? You know how much he loves you. Your father has never said anything about his encounter with anyone and it fails to be true. Mom, tell dad to go deal with his past and allow me to enjoy my life with whoever I choose to enjoy it with. Gina. Sorry, Mom. Greetings, my queen. What have you come to do here? You have come to see if we are sad about the rejection, right? No, my queen. I am very sorry for what happened today. I'm truly sorry. But on the contrary, I have come to let you know that even if my father rejects Uzo, I will never reject Uzo. Before you reject someone, you have to check first if you fit into that person's life. Come on. Who is rejecting who? Well, I blame Uzo for all this. All the same, ma'am. I, I am sorry. Let me, let me see Uzo. Open the door. Can you hear me? Get out. Just get out. Go home. I don't ever want to see you again. Just go. 
What are you doing here? Why are you making noise? This is not a marketplace. Here is a palace. The palace of Umoma. So get out of here before I lose it. Take your noise somewhere else. I'm very sorry, my queen. Truly, I am. But I just want to talk to him. What do you want to tell him? And who is that your wretched father, anyway? Go to him. Go. Honey, honey, please just open the door, okay? Honey. What did I just say? What did I just tell you? I'm sorry. Or do you want me to use the cards on you? No, oh, my queen. I'm sorry. I was. You cannot be sorry, and you're still here. Get lost. This is the worst day of my life. I wish I can turn back the hands of time. That man, that useless man, has the God to tell me that I cannot marry his daughter. Who the hell does he think he is? Get lost. Get lost. Don't you ever knock on this door again. Sorry, my prince. I wanted to know if you're ready to eat. Food is ready. Get lost. Out. that man did today was a sign of hatred and I will not take it lightly with him. I am going to spit back on his face for spitting on my face before Ono. Your father is one man I respect his personality and instinct a lot. What instinct? What kind of instinct will make my father reject my suitor? My father is rejecting us on the basis that he does not like his father. Who does that? What does he know about Uzo and how much he loves me? Calm down, Gina. Calm down. Why not take your time to see if what your father is saying about this family is true or not? Oh, babe, stop it. My father knows nothing about Uzo's family. I do. Besides, I am the one who will be living with Uzo in the palace, not my father. Listen, I know what I want. And I will go all out to get it. Can I ask you a genuine question? Ahead. Why is your relationship with Ozo a secret? Why? Oh, that. Ozo wanted it that way. Whatever his reason is, I don't know. But I respect exactly what I am talking about. Why would he want you to keep your relationship with him a secret after all you've done for him? You think 
sake I don't know. Of course I know you sold your car and other property just to get him out of the mess. I know. I... Gina, I am your girlfriend. I have never betrayed your trust. You're like a sister to me. I cannot tell you anything bad. Please, my friend, can you listen to your father's advice? He will never lead you astray. Please, can you listen to his advice? I am begging you. The doctor has warned you to quit tobacco. Mom, I'm here to relax, not to talk. If what happened today did not happen, would you have ever believed that she is not worth your time? Mom, please don't start this again. You know what Gina has done in my life? What else has she done if not to throw herself at you? What responsible woman would sell her car and property just to get hold of a man? Mom, please. Enough of this, please. You know the kind of man I am. I'm not the kind of man you bring a woman to marry. Stay away from my affairs with Gina. Please. If I finally get married to Gina and you're not comfortable with it, you can move to the old house. I beg your pardon. Is that your plan? Oh, both of you have planned to chase me out of my husband's palace? <laughs> well, the battle line has been drawn. Good night. Good night. <sighs> Apart from what your father said in the afternoon, I have asked him a few questions. And I've come to realize that he knows that family has an ungrateful family. Really? Mom, like really? Can you be kind enough to answer me just this one question? Am I not the one who will live in that palace with Uzo? We are in love. We are happy. Isn't that all that matters? Gina, you have chosen not to listen. I will neither listen to you nor listen to Dad. If he doesn't want me to marry Uzo, it's fine, no, no problem. But I will have you know, Mother, that I will get pregnant for him. Or better still, have a court wedding. You don't want your father to disown you, do you? Oh, please. Pray, Mother. Pray I don't get to that part first. Because I will disown him without a thought. What? Excuse me. I thought he smiled. I thought he But he smiled. Forever. Yes. Morning. Morning. If I were you, I would fuck 
forget about these people. If you hear what the queen said about you and your family here today, you will not show your face here. Really? Yes. <sighs> My dear, thank you for your concern. But as you can see, I am not here for the queen. I am here for Uzo, my love. Okay? Sorry, oh sorry. It's fine. I have sacrificed a lot just for our love. I have done what I should not do. My father is the cause of all this. And if anything happens to my relationship with Uzo, I will never forgive him. Never. Is it the ones you bought in Gina's name? Yes, I kept it here. And I've been looking for it since when I couldn't find it. Have you asked Gina? Because she once mentioned to me that she wanted to rent out those shops. Why? Why would she do a thing like that without letting me know? I wanted to sell the lands and use the proceeds for my post operation. Why would she do a thing like that? I, I thought she told you. Just calm down. When she comes to Father, if what you did yesterday brings an end to my relationship with Uzo, oh, I swear I will never forgive you. Oh, shut up! Christ. Gina, Gina, where is the document? of the shops at no site. You bought the shops in my name, if I am correct. Yes. Well, I had personal problems that needed to be solved. So I sold them and solved my problem. You did what? You sold the shops without my consent? Now oh, I see. I want the money from the sales of those properties returned to me tomorrow afternoon. I'm sorry, Dad. But there's absolutely no money to be returned. <laughs> you see the other side of me when tomorrow comes and you try to bring me money. Are you crazy? What is wrong with you? <sighs> sit down. I said sit! <sighs> now tell me. What did you do with the money you realized from the sale of those shops? I am talking to you. And I ask again, what did you do with the money you realized from the sale of those shops? More. Are you being serious like right now? We are dealing with something much more important and we sit down here and talk about that 
money. I got humiliated in the presence of my suitor. I got humiliated in the presence of the royal household. And all we can talk about is that money. Really? Like, like, really? Oh, shut up! I will not allow you banter words with me. Where is the money? Mother, I do not even want to banter words with you. So I will make this real quick. I used the money for a business. <sighs> Gina, make sure you bring that money back to your father. By the way, where is the car your father left for you? Shit. Mom, are we still talking about dad's properties? Are we? Now it's a car. Well, I will have you know that I had that soul too. Are we clear? You what? You heard me, mother. You sold the car your father left in your care? Jina, how could you be this callous? What has come over you? Oh! You know what? Make sure you bring that money back before your father is due for pressure. Did you hear me? That's money, that's shops, that's properties. That's what everybody care about. And what about my feelings? Guess nobody cares. I don't care too. Hello. What's up? Hello, Barry. You think you can set me up in South Africa and get away with it? Listen, I did not set you up. Bilo did. <laughs> I am coming for you. Be prepared. I am coming. Hello? 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 I am going to a place where I can find peace. <laughs> where you can find peace, you said? You heard me. Okay. Have you given your father his money? Oh, that. When I have the money, I will bring it to him. <sighs> now listen. Make sure you don't leave this house without giving your father the money. Else, he will disown you. Maybe you should ask me if I haven't done that already. What he did to me coming from a father is evil. Bye, mother. Gina, you're biting more than you can chew. Whatever. Gina! Honey, I am so sorry about what happened the other day. Listen, I have come to stay with you. I want you to know that no matter what happens, I will never leave your side. You hear me? It's all right. I'll find a way out. That's fine. Mm -hmm. You're all dressed. Where are you going? I'm going to see a client. 
and I'll be back in two hours. Okay? Oh, okay. hold on. Hello? I am coming. Why are you calling me like this? I'm coming. Stop. Stop. I'm, I'll see you. All right. I'm waiting. Yeah. I said I'm coming. Stop this threat, please. Good morning, my queen. What are your bags doing inside? My queen. Will you shut I... up? I can see your family does not know what it wants. I knew you would come back to beg. It's obvious you have come to test my resolve, right? No. We shall see. I finally wed Uzo. All these insults will stop. His mother will understand that I am a potential queen and she will mind the way she talks to me. Hello, Uncle Joe. Good morning, sir. I'm fine, thank you. Uncle, I don't know what my father told you, but I have my own side of the story. I'm free, I'm not doing anything now. I should come now. Okay, sir, I'll come now, I'll be on my way now. Thank you, sir. When my Uzo comes back, tell him I've gone to see my uncle, okay? Okay, I hear you. I don't know why some people do right joy in fooling themselves. Excuse you. I said I hear you. No, you said something else. No, no. I want to know what that... I wasn't talking to you. Oh, I see. Uncle, Uzo and I have been together for two years. I do not know why my father thinks that he can just wake up and choose a husband for me. Is that right, Uncle? I did not call you here for that. What I want to know from you is, why did you sell off his shop? Well, Uncle, my father gave me the shop. He gave me the shop. We were all there when he bought the shop. And he made it very clear that he bought the shop in your name because he did not want to tamper with the money until something crucial comes up for him to need the money. <sighs> Uncle, yes. I already sold the shop. Trust me, I don't know why we're still sitting here talking about the same shop. Oh, now... Your father needs some money for his surgery. Why don't you give him some money? I'm sorry. I used the money for a bigger business. Gina, now you are about failing us. The petrol station your father left in your care has not been working for the past few months. Only yesterday, one of your staff 
told me that you have sold off all the trucks without your father's consent. Gina, where is the money? Who is this man that is fooling you and taking the money? Uncle, I'm sorry. I thought you called me here to tell me that you tell my father to let me marry the man of my dream. I, I was not expecting all this. I mm. wasn't. Mm. Yes, sir. Now, let me tell you something. Nothing must happen to my brother. If anything happens to him, <laughs> Gina, I will not take it lightly with you. Um, Uncle, uh, I take that to be that we are done here. Mm. Uh, I'm sorry, I mean no disrespect, Uncle, but please let me go now. Please. Thank you, sir. You don't know that he's suffering from the heart attack you and your father caused him. Listen, if anything should happen to my son, I will never forgive your family. Your Majesty? Yes, Doctor. I would like to speak with you. My son. He needs an urgent uh, kidney transplant. What? As his kidneys are badly damaged. Kidney transplant? My God. We have to be very fast about it. Excuse me, please. Kidney transplant. My son. My son. My son. Mm. Oh, please help me. I don't want to die. Please. Call Frank to help me, please. Son. I don't want to die. You will not die. I will do something. Nothing will happen mm. to you, please. Mm. Um, please. I'm scared. I'm scared I don't want to die. Please help me. Can you stop talking about death? <sighs> Nobody is dying. Mm. I, 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 I'll do something. I, I won't let anything happen, okay? <sighs> please. Oh, where is Gina? I told her to wait outside. I want to see her. Son, please, let us stay outside. Mm. After all, we, 
It was her and her father that brought this upon us. Oh, mom, mom, please send for her, please. Okay, I will. Uh, but don't be scared, okay? Nothing is happening. I... Sorry. The doctor said that he might not survive this week if nothing is done. Mom, I do not have money to send anyone to Egypt or India. Mom, I am struggling to send my product after my encounter with Navdak. Who is talking about India here? Frank, <laughs> please me... help your brother leave. Mom, let me understand. Are you telling me to donate one of my kidneys to Ozo? We wouldn't let him die. Oh, I'm sorry. I cannot do that. When I was warning Ozo to stop drinking and smoking, he never listened. Now you're asking me to donate one of my kidneys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Not even a pint of my blood. If anything should happen to him, I will kill myself. Mom, you can give him your own so that he can... to see you. He's been stooling blood. The doctor said if we don't do something fast, we may lose him. What do I do? What do I do now? I'm so helpless. My queen. I can help. What? I've made up my mind to donate one of my kidneys so Uzo can leave. Ah, thank you. God bless you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for saving my son's life. Thank you. I will not forget this. Thank you. Gina. Hmm? 
I want to thank you for accepting to save the life of my beloved brother. <laughs> and you know I love Uzo so much. I can do anything for him. My prayer is that God should make this surgery a successful one. God willing, it will be successful. Mm -hmm. And you'll be remembered for this. We will never forget it. Never. Okay? In this kingdom, you will always be remembered for your selfless sacrifice. Thank you once again. <laughs> You're welcome. But you see, you don't need to thank me. You're such a nice person. And you've got a beautiful heart. I pray your beautiful heart brings you good tidings. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. Sweetheart, are you scared? Please, don't be. Be strong, okay? I am not scared. And if anything happens to me, please tell Uzo that I love him so much. Please. Nothing is going to happen to you. Okay? It's going to be a successful one. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me. Do not be scared at all. I'm here. Okay? Hello, Mom. Mommy, where are you? You're still on the road. Oh, my God. Mommy, you should be here by now. Mom, what do you mean by why is she wasting so much time? You, you think it's that easy? You think it's an easy one? Mom, please, just... By any means, get here quick, please.
हेलो हेलो about Gina. Well, I don't care. As long as my son is fine. Mom. Mom, you sounded so worried over the phone. Are you okay? To me. Please, have you seen Gina? No, is everything okay? I had a terrible dream about her. I called her, but she wasn't picking. I'm worried. Mom, I was with her when she got a call from the palace that Uzo is sick. I think she's with them now. Oh, Gina should not do this to me. Down, it was just a dream. Then let her be called. Let her be called. You're talking as if you do not know your daughter again, mommy. Her phone is always on silent, and you know this. Mommy, don't worry yourself, okay? I will go and check up on her myself, and I will tell her to call you as soon as possible. Please do. I'm expecting to hear from you. I will. It's okay. It was just a dream. It was so real. Mommy, you are her mother. Pray for her. She will be fine. Okay. Is there reason you want to call? I don't know. <laughs> okay, mommy. Later. Alright. to the hospital. The prince is critically ill and he has been booked for an operation. You can repeat the visit next time. Um, okay, um, did my friend go with them? And who is your friend? Oh, sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Tonia. I am Gina's friend. I am here to see her. Oh, Auntie Gina. Yes, she went with them. Do you mind telling me the name of the hospital? Yes, St. Jude's Hospital. Yes, St. Jude's Hospital. St. Jude's Hospital. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Good evening. Hello, can I help you? Uh, yes. My name is Tonia. I am Gina's friend. I went to the palace and I was told you people came to this place. So I decided to come see her here. 
Okay, your Gina's friend. Yes. She was here, but she has left. Like I said, my name is Tonia and I am Gina's friend. I am here to see her because her mom has been worried about her. Please, I need to see her so I will be able to tell the mother to calm down that she's all right. Yeah, she's fine. She was here earlier, but she has left. I brought his son back so that I can go back and live my baby girl's life. That's oh. all. Oh. Welcome, my dear. Hmm? You can rest for now. Then you go tomorrow. That is if you still want to go. Prince Uzo, you are not saying anything. Is this boy your son? I uh, know. I think at this particular point, we have to start asking crucial questions. By asking crucial questions? You mean? No, you think I'm lying? She thinks I'm lying. Listen, I have money. Hmm. And Uzo knows it. I have everything I want in this life. So I'm not here for his money. As a matter of fact, I have enough money to feed the whole community. That's yes, you heard me. That's a real woman talking here. When you see a real woman, you know. Hmm? Did you hear what she said? <sighs> eh? no, let me take you to your room. You said enough for one day. No, no, I, 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 I'd rather receive some fresh air here. Mm -hmm. Well, in that case, yeah. Let me take you around. Okay. 